My beloved love, I just get the sense of some kind of year-long cycle completing itself. For some of you, this might even be an 18-month cycle. So this actually could have been a cycle that began in around, I would say, March or April of 2022. What else can I channel for the collective here in the near future? This exact card actually came out in a recent reading. So wow, I see a globe. Someone could be considering traveling internationally or seeing more of the world or something along those lines. This also could speak to having a soul connection with someone that lives across the world or in a very different part of the world from you. But again, that won't be for everyone necessarily within the near future. I'm hearing something is right around the corner. And again, this card came out in a recent reading as well. When it came out in the recent reading, it felt almost like this pressure-building kind of energy, but not in a negative sense, like the sense of being really restless as a child before Christmas, that kind of excitement. It's making me think of how I actually channeled a video once about how a sign of twin flame connection can be getting this, what I refer to as a Christmas morning feeling, prior to connecting with a twin flame in the physical world. And this is that kind of jittery, restless, excited feeling with nothing concrete to really attach to it. That is sometimes your soul sensing the entrance of a really powerful soul connection. In the case of that context, a twin flame, but this also can happen with very intense soulmate connections as well, anyone we share a really powerful soul bond with. I don't know why that's coming through. It's making me think that someone might be in a pending reunion or union kind of state with a soulmate or a twin flame. You could have one of these types of connections about to enter or re-enter your life. So what can I channel about this powerful soul connection that might be right around the corner here? I'm hearing something about bumping into or running into each other in the physical world in some kind of a natural way. So if this is someone new that you're meeting or that you met recently, this is someone that you run into or meet coincidentally. If this is someone from your past, then you might cross paths in the physical world in a very unexpected way, or they might unexpectedly reach out and want to connect physically. But for whoever I am speaking to here, the numbers 12 and 7 may resonate with you. We're also getting the Temple Path card and the Community card. So this tells me that this particular person wants to meet up in the physical world with you. Either they are literally reaching out to ask to meet up with you, or their higher self is coordinating them to run into you in the physical world. With Healer of the Ages, this could be a masculine or divine masculine energy, although that doesn't necessarily have to be the case. This is someone who, I'm hearing, wants to show you how much they've grown or they want to show you how much they've healed. From Divine Muscular, type yes if you believe.